There are concerns. Proposed development in the Deer Creek area is going to further crowd schools and add to traffic issues. Fox 25's Tom Ferguson has been digging into the details here. So, Tom, what does that area look like now? Look at this picture right now. It's just a bunch of trees and small brush, but that could all change if plans go through. The sound of cars driving by is about the loudest thing you'll hear around Northwestern Avenue and Coffee Creek Road, just west of Edmond. This is the land where a developer wants to build about 175 homes on half acre lots, along with some commercial spaces on larger plots. Residents have taken to social media to debate the proposal. One woman commented, quote, this will crowd our schools even more. The land falls within the boundaries for Deer Creek Public Schools, but opinions differ on whether this should go forward. One man responded to the woman's post saying, quote, we have to grow or we will wither and waste away. Additional property taxes will help fund teacher salaries if we can find the teachers. Residents have the chance to tell officials what they think about this proposal. This notice went out to those who live nearby. They're invited to an Oklahoma County Planning Commission public hearing where the zoning change will be considered. The woman called on residents to quote, help spread the word and send protest emails. We reached out to Miles Davidson, the county commissioner representing the area to see if he had any thoughts. His office said since this is so new, he didn't have any comment yet. We also wanted to know if the school district had any concerns about overcrowding. We reached out but have not received a response. And that public hearing will take place at the county office building in downtown Oklahoma City on September 19th at 1.30 p.m. The county is asking for any written comments against the development by the 18th at noon. You can drop those off in person, by mail, or by emailing planning at okcounty.org. Reporting live, Tom Ferguson, back to you.